Hey guys, it's Lily. I'm a full-time reseller on Poshmark, Mercari, Kitizen, and here. <clears throat> and today I'm just going to do, um, I haven't even really looked through these. I separated them out. It came from a Goodwill Blue Box, five pound jewelry the other day. I know I did pick all the earrings out, so there's no earrings in here. There's just necklaces and bracelets. Some's going to be crafts, some's going to be good, some's going to be junk. Um... But I'll try to get through it really quick and give you some really good prices. So, I will put, um, probably not put them on the screen unless I just don't really know at the moment. I'll say what the price is. If you could please uh, send me a screenshot or or the timestamp or describe it or something. Um, so, it'll be the price that I say, $5 in shipping. If it's under a pound in the U.S., anything over that is going to be based on where you live. So, um... Yeah, let me put you on hold and we'll get started. Just a sec. Okay, sorry guys, no fails this time. It's late. I just kind of want to get through this jewelry. Um, anyway, so this is, I believe, all the necklaces. So we'll go through those first. First, we have a brand new. Uh, paparazzi it is earrings just a silver tone chain with a little medallion and it says let your light shine Matthew 516 um, so yeah two dollars I know you can get paparazzi five dollars all day long so hopefully you pick, you pick this and something else to make it worth your while. Alright, this is on a leather strap. Of course, I would, you know me, I would ditch the leather. Uh, maybe make my own leather, but look at that lion. This is stone. I don't know what kind of stone it is. Um, but that is very pretty. So let's go $5 on that. <clears throat> and this, I didn't really untangle it. I just kind of... I just kind of separated it by what it was. Oh, it would help if I ended the clasps. I didn't give you a link on that necklace because, uh, uh the lion ne necklace, because, all right, this is ridiculous. Roller, cra roller clasp here. It's got a little bit of wear, uh, just a tiny bit. <clears throat> oh, come on. Definitely see my frustration today. I don't know what this is, but it's holding up everything. But it better be good. Pain in the butt like that. Oh, I know what it is. This thing. Let me just undo that little sucker clasp. It's giving me such a hard time. Do that with a booger neck. Okay. Love this. This is all good. I'll slow down here in a second. Sorry for making you dizzy. Alright. This is beautiful wood. These are like hand carved. These are not. Um, but it's very long. Long wood necklace. Very lightweight. It has brass. With a roller clasp. And it is very long. Very long. It is 27 inches. <clears throat> so we're going to put $5 on this beauty. She is party. 
Now, the culprit. The one that was tangling everything. This is very heavy. I don't know what it is. It is both sides are um, have the blue and the red stones mimicking turquoise and coral. <sighs> but it is not signed. It is very heavy. It is this um, like brass tone pretty even no, it's not marked so it's marked on the inside there um, but it's heavy and it's beautiful in my opinion for being brass um, it is very pretty <clears throat> and it is How many times can I lose my tape measure? It is thirty inches. Thirty inches long. Very nice. Let's go um six dollars on that one. Oh, goodness. This is a very long gold chain. I'm going to have to test this one. It does have a roller clasp. And I believe it does say something. It looks as if, if it's not gold, it's definitely plated. Because it's beautiful. You know, the color... See if I can make anything out here. Of course not. But it is gorgeous. I do not see anywhere there is some. There's textured and smooth links, double link, all the way. It's a beautiful necklace. This I will have to put a price on the screen, so sorry about that. I figured I could just do it. This is, wow, 50 inches long. This would be beautiful. Doubled. Yep. It's a beautiful necklace. So yeah, let me um let me test this first. I mean, you know, it's color plated. Let's do the 18 karat first. Can you see that? Put it in your view. Well, that just like totally disappeared really quick. I don't know why I bothered to do the 10, but I'm going to do the 10. So the 10 is staying. 14, let's see if the 14 goes away. And it does. So, it is probably plated. So, let's just say, um, let's just put $10 on it. It is a beautiful chain. You could put so many things on it. Actually, hold please. Okay, I'm back. I thought... I don't know if you guys remember seeing this on Marilyn's channel. I bought this beautiful uh, pendant from her. It was missing a stone here. 
Um, but I have several Swarovski crystals that I have been buying over the years. Um, actually, there's two missing. Maybe three. Um, but I have them. Maybe four. Yeah, I have them to fix this. It's, it, it's just beautiful. So I was hoping that maybe this chain would work. Um, and it would, except for I can't double it because it's not a clip. Um, it would just be a pain in the butt to get it to work. I would really have to play with it to get it to be at the right angle. So, no, this is not the right chain, although I think it would be beautiful with it. So, yeah, still $10. I did, I did get the earrings to match, too, by the way. Yep, 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 yep. Thank you, Marilyn. Love them. Can't wait to wear them. Anyway, let me get that stuff out of the way so I don't try to sell it with everything. So, yeah, gold chain. 50 inches. $10. Good deal. Good buy. Oops. Okay, try to be quick here. I was sure hoping that chain would work for my pendant, but it won't. So I love that chain. Okay, these are just faux um, acrylic pearls. They're kind of a ivory color. There's a better, a little bit dirty, but they could probably be cleaned. Yeah, see? That came right off. Um, so they do need to be cleaned. We do have a brass roller clasp here. I swear. I'm losing my mind. How many times you guys heard me say that in the last week? I'm losing my mind. Yeah, 22 inches, so it's a good length. So, $2 on that, and while we're doing that, we've got a pretty set of red ones. They are knotted in between. They have this funky silver roller clasp. It has some wear, but it's still very wearable. It's just all screen vintage to me. I don't know. Six, 17 inches on the red ones. Two dollars for those as well. <clears throat> I loved this one. Um, but it's broken. These are nice. They are plastic or acrylic, but the colors are just beautiful. The colors of Easter. Um, so a dollar. Okay, this is brass, I believe. Not magnetic. The chain is. Um, it is just a beautiful heart. It's not magnetic. It has a little bit of a puff to it. And it's a good two inches across. I know some of you don't like me doing measurements. That's been made very clear in my videos. But you know what? Most people want them. So you're getting them. That's literally being pissy. Two by two. With a little bit of puff. Nice heart. Still four dollars on that. Got another set of ivory colored pearls with a silver tone clasp. They are also hand mounted in between. And 
these are 17 inches. Oh, this one was nice. These are glass. And you've got some milk glass. Um, beautiful milk glass. Some beveled all glass. It's broken. But the beads are beautiful. So I'm still going to put $4 on this. Because the beads are just absolutely gorgeous. And I can use this for a project that I am working on. For Christmas if nobody buys it so it's not a big deal to me and that's the four dollar price tag all right this is cute very lightweight wood just a wooden necklace with a brass tone clasp unmarked but it's in good condition And it's 16 inches long. So let's just put $4 on that one. I told you that was going to be a good deal this time. There's a couple here. I'm going to have to put prices on the screen. Um, I think this is one of them. Because I don't know. I think this is one of the ones I didn't know who it was. This is an ab absolutely gorgeous. No, this is the Avon one. Oh my god, it is so heavy. I mean, heavy. It's gold tone, silver tone, mixed metal, and just look at this chain. I mean, it is a beautiful, beautiful chain. There's your hang tag. What does that say? Oh, the SP are the initials of the artist who made this for Avon. I don't know if you guys know anything about that. Whenever you see an Avon and then you have initials behind it, um, that means that's the initials of the ones that designed the piece for Avon to sell. But, you know, most people know about that. It is not magnetic. And it is heavy, heavy, heavy. One of the heaviest pieces I've seen for Avon. Um, all right, this is 33 inches long. Your bail is two and a quarter by one and a half. Let's see if this comes off. I don't think it does. Sometimes these come off, but no, this one does not. But I mean, you know, if you wanted to use the chain for some ways, but I'm telling you, this is heavy. So I am, um, I'm putting $10 on this and I think $10 is cheap. That I would probably list it closer to 30 on Poshmark. Look at the owl. I can't see it yet. Is it even in your view yet? Isn't that cute? Cute. But it's tangled. Alright. The owl is a silver tone. Looks like it has a few little um, marcasite pieces. I don't see any missing. Black eyes. Very nice. That's not marked. And it's just a slip over chain. So there. There is no mark. But this is beautiful. It really is. So if you like owls. You're going to love that. No clasp. It's 
so keep that in mind. It's 29, the chain is 29 inches. The owl itself is about two and a half. By one and a half. So yeah, I'm going to measure them for you because some of you want to know. And I'm sorry if you don't like it. If you don't like it, please don't watch. Because 99% of the people want to know what the measurements are. Yeah, that's Lily being pissy again. Lily's pissy today. Tomorrow's St. Patrick's Day and... Ollie wore his green shirt today, and so he doesn't have any green to wear tomorrow. This is a really pretty piece. Silver tone. It all has all these different colored beads and silver tone. It's got a little bit of wear. It is. They are acrylic. And I'm sure that it's magnetic. Yep. And it is. Thirty inches with a three inch extender. So let's just say um it is in good condition. Three dollars for that. Hold off on that one. Okay, here we go. Make sure this clasp works. Yep. Does have a little bit of wear on the clasp itself. It is pretty dainty. Yellow tone, wood beads. Um, this has like a little tassel on the end there. Um, yeah, that is, that's pretty. I'm going to put $3 on this one. It is very wearable. Um, and we are 16 inches. It's two inches. Pain in the ass. The three and a half inch drop on the little tassel. What did I put on that? What did I put on that? Just put $3 on that. Yeah, this is extremely beautiful. They are glass. It is old. Silver tone. This, I think I'm going to have to put something on the screen. Because if I recall, it is marked. It is marked. It is marked 925. These are glass. Beautiful glass. Beautiful glass beads. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put a price on the screen. Um, well, actually, I'm going to say a price. If I put a price on the screen, that means I've changed it. And I will apologize. This is your clasp. It's a very unusual clasp. I mean, I know it looks like a lobster clasp, but it's not. It's a kind of a squared off. Because there may be a maker's mark there that I cannot read. But right here is where it says the 925. Um, so I'm going to put... I'm going to put 15 on this one because this is very unique and very beautiful. It is 18 inches. With a 2 inch extender. Beautiful piece. Beautiful piece.
<laughs> Lord, help me. Help me, help me. Help me out of this mess. I have jewelry. I have jewelry coming out of my ears. I'll never get it listed all. I'll listen. I don't know why this one's got a price tag on it, but it's new. It's a new. It's new and it's tangled. Alright. Beautiful gold cone. Very long. And it is loft. Um, it has this drop flower tassel with faux pearls. It's a beautiful necklace. And it's in very good condition. So let's see. This doesn't have a extender, but it is 32 inches long. And I got a headache today. Uh, and about a four inch drop on the uh, tassel. So um, let's just say six on the loft necklace. And I don't remember seeing this one. It feels pretty, but it's not marked. Gold tone. It's not marked at all. Um, it's got a little knot in it, which I will get out. But it is just a very simple pearl and uh, a pinkish red stone. I think it's um, a rhinestone, but it is in good condition. So we'll do four dollars on that one. And it is seventeen inches. That's about a half inch for the um, the little pendant. So there's that. Can you hear the bells are ringing? It's not bells. It's just a beautiful collar necklace for those of you who like collar necklaces. Look at what we have here. Look how beautiful that is. It is in very good condition. Silver tone. Let's see. The beads say. France something or another. It is not marked. <clears throat> it's got blue stones. No doubt they are acrylic. Yep, they are acrylic. Silver tone. The back looks like that. It is really in good condition. It's going to be hard to get you a Good measurement on that. Uh, so I'm going to say it's about 16 inches with a 3 inch extender. And I'm probably, it's probably a little bit better than, than that. Let me see. Let me try something. Well, I have plenty of room on my neck, so, um, what did I say, six dollars? Let's just say six dollars. I know what. A couple more, and then a couple bracelets. Oh, here was another one of those really pretty ones. None of this March 925. I don't know who this maker is, but oh my gosh. So now we have one in purple, which I do not have my Presidium out to know if this is amethyst or glass. So 
I will check that. But it's definitely glass. And it is sterling. Let me just make sure. I can't read it. I think this says sterling. The other one was definitely sterling. Can you even see? Probably not. I'm pretty sure this is sterling. Just like the other one that I had $15 on. Yep. Look there. Whoop. Purr. Pay blue. Okay. So. I'm going to go ahead and put $15 on this one too. So you don't have to wait. But like I said with the other one, if I find out they are something totally spect spectacular, I will apologize and have the corrected price on the screen. Okay, here is a beautiful condition silver tone necklace. It is cell marked. But it says friends forever true friend and a heart okay so these uh, this is marked a j m c yeah a j m c which i don't know who that is. I don't see sterling anywhere. Um, but it's definitely in really good condition. It is a friend necklace. Um, very pretty. That heart is really pretty. Kind of iridescent like uh, Aurora Borealis. Pink pretty um i will put a price on the screen for this one only because i don't know that that um brand <laughs> i need a stationary um measuring tool okay so this is 16 inches with an inch and a half extender i'll put a price on the screen for that one That one I was going to do. But, uh, guys, here's this, this, this little rope thingamajiggers again. You know I hate these. This is a New York NY. Can you see that? It's like this suede rope thing that it's a choker, then it hangs down a little bit further. I don't know. It's going into craft for a dollar. I'm not even going to measure it because it doesn't make any sense to me to even wear. Doesn't mean it doesn't make sense to you, but it makes absolutely no sense to the more. Alright. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Turquoise chain, silver chain, in great condition. And it is somebody I don't know. Anybody know that tag? I don't know it. So I'll have to put a price on the screen. SB, maybe. It's got a little chip here, uh, rhinestone. Excellent condition. I'll put a price on the screen for that one. How many minutes are we at? No idea. Alright, we're at 16. And a 3 inch extender. Um, yeah, I'm going to put a price on the screen for that one. And this one, for you butterfly lovers, this is the most gorgeous butterfly necklace I think I have ever seen. 
It is a silver tone mesh. And it is like 3D-ish. And it's got these beautiful bright orange rhinestones and some clear rhinestones. I did test the stones. I will be honest, they are not gemstone. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous necklace. It is just beautiful. And it is made by I can't remember. Um, but I know that a twelve dollar price for it was uh, reasonable. So twelve dollars on the beautiful butterfly necklace. Let's get your measurement. You guys realize I have to pick this up off the floor every time I say that, right? Because it falls. All right, that is 14 inches with a four inch extender. So up to 18 inches. And you know, you got to account for this little B here too. So it's probably about 16 inches with the four inch extender, um, but it's beautiful. All right. You want me to go to the um, bracelets or we quit? What if I just do a couple of them and then we'll quit because I think it's been long enough. Oh, beautiful pen. Antique. Antique brooch. It has some color loss on, on the blue. Um, gold tone. Could use a buff. It does not have a maker. With the Rolo, Rolo class. Um, beautiful, beautiful brooch, though. And it's out of metal. Um, so let's just say $5 for that. And then we have this beautiful kitty brooch. I think he's made out of ceramic. It's ceramic or stone. I think it's ceramic. But he sure is pretty. Um, forget the name of that cat with the tiger stripes, what they call them. Anyway, there is the back. There is a brooch. Six dollars for the kitty. Great condition. And uh, who is this? I have to wait on this one because I don't know who it is. It's got to lots of numbers. So we'll wait on this one. But this, this is, I think this is Tweety Bird. Is that Tweety Bird? We'll wait until the next one on that one. It's not a big deal. It'll be here. All right. So here we have a double gold. Um, bracelet and it is actually double see there's space in between there uh, it is bendable but oh my goodness is it hard to get on all right there you go that is what it would look like on that was not easy for me to get on Ouch, did you guys notice my pen I also bought this from Marilyn at Shady and Why. This elephant is absolutely gorgeous. Yep. So you can wear your pins on anything. It doesn't have to be just on your chest. I would not go more than a six and a half on this bracelet. Um, so let's go. Let's go four dollars on that since it's so small. Um, this is the weirdest thing ever. It's a seed bead belt, okay? 
silver CD belt, and it is long. I think it could fit just about anybody. It's got little tassels on it. I guess it would look nice with the black dress. So let me just measure it. <laughs> I'm excited to go to this time. Whoops. See? I told you. It ended up on the floor again. <clears throat> Goodness, I wanted to be done with this bag, but oh well. This is the last one. Last one. And it is... Come on. Stay still. I'm giving you an approximate... Um, 40, so wait, times 2, 80 inches, you got 80 inches of seed bead, well they're not seed bead, they're the long ones, and I believe they're glass, um, it's not too heavy though, um, silver tone, it could be used as a belt, it could be used as just about anything, I'm just going to put $5 on that, um, use your imagination. And that's it for this video. I will try to finish up the rest of the bag later. Because um, you got Ollie's video tomorrow night. So I will talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for spending. I don't know. God probably was an hour this time. Who knows. I apologize. Um, I just can't seem to get through them fast enough. So I will talk to you guys again soon. Lily out.